A win's a win, right? Well, it depends on who you ask. And even though Marquette only scored 19 points in the first half, they still came away with the win. Saturday's matchup with Robert Morris looked like a good opportunity for the Golden Eagles to get back on track. However, it was the turnovers and lackluster offense that showed up at Pfizer 4. Obviously, we were being loose with the ball, and uh, we had a lot of a lot of travel calls, especially first and second half. You know, so that's things we got that are real sloppy that we got to clean up. You know, those are mistakes that we can control. You know, so we just got to get back to uh, get back doing the fundamentals and things like that. You know, because we can't afford to have those those uh, those little turnovers, especially going into Orlando. We're going to be playing some big time opponents. The first half was hard on the eyes, and Marcus Howard was nowhere to be found. But then, out of the break, the Golden Eagles were led by some unlikely candidates. It was really good, you know. I, yeah, Brendan would tell you; he'd be the first to tell you that uh, that he he could have played better to open the season. Um, however, you know, I thought uh, you know he was huge for us this afternoon, um, and you know it was good to see that that lid come off the basket for him. And uh, but I thought also thought he did some good things defensively as well. I thought Scar, you know, really played like a veteran. Um, uh, strong drives. I thought he played with a, a senior's presence, so I thought he was he was huge for us. Uh, you know, when his backcourt mates didn't necessarily have the games that they're accustomed and or capable of having. Marquette looked like a different team in the second half. But Robert Morris wasn't going away easily. With 30 seconds to go, Dante Treacy nailed a three to make it a three-point game. But that wasn't enough, as Marquette was able to hold on to get the victory. From Pfizer Forum, alongside Jack Phillips, I'm Shane Hogan, Marquette Wire Sports. Thanks for watching this video. For more METV sports content posted every day, click the subscribe button right here on your screen or follow us on Twitter at MUWire Sports.